In this video, I'm gonna show you a free tool that's going to add over 1,400 prompt templates into ChatGPT. I have no idea how it's free, but it is. This is a tool that everyone needs to install. It's gonna help you create better prompts, come up with better ideas and things to use ChatGPT for. The best part is it's community fueled, so people are constantly adding new templates. You can upvote them. Enough talking about it. Let's get into my computer and actually show you what it is. All right, let's go. Okay, so you'll notice right away, this is not what your ChatGPT looks like. This is what ChatGPT looks like after we've installed a free Chrome extension called AIPRM. APRM. I don't know how they call it. AIPRM. Uh, but once you install it, it's going to show up right here inside of ChatGPT every single time that you log in. Now, it is a extension that will just sit up here. You don't have to do anything with it. You can pin it there just so you can see it, make sure it's on. But there's really nothing that we actually do with the extension itself. It's just gonna add this functionality inside of ChatGPT. Okay, so let me show you what this is really doing. So if you see here, it's showing one to 20 of 1,469 prompts. So if we scroll down here, we'll start to see a bunch of different prompts. And I believe that they are listed here by most viewed. So as you see here, this first one, human written content, SEO optimized, 575.2 thousand views. So if you aren't using this, a lot of other people are, so you probably should get on it too. Uh, and then in, over here, it has a like option where you can actually vote up things, which is super cool, especially if you're creating your own prompts. It's nice to see that people are actually using them and enjoying them. But let's keep scrolling down. This one right here, this is super cool. A mid journey prompt generator. Let's go ahead and click on that and test it out. So. This was by Kenny. Thank you, Kenny. You can change the tone. So for this one, since it's going to be a mid-journey prompt, we're not gonna do anything with that. So let's say, cute cat. Would you like my cute cat picture back there? Okay, and it's gonna give me this crazy prompt. And I'll let it give me several others, but for now, let's hop into mid-journey. And let's see what that generates. Okay, and while we're waiting on that, let's go through some other ones. We'll come back to that. All right, next, better content outlines, audit existing content for SEO. So a lot of these are going to be for bloggers. It started out, I believe, strictly as a tool for SEO and blogging, but they've gone well beyond that now. It just might take a while for the other prompts to kind of catch up in terms of popularity. Also, we can kind of zoom out here so we can see even more. And this one is insanely popular. Rewrite your article to sound like it is completely human generated. So, so cool. And you know, you can do that with other stuff, but this one is already done for you. Also, if you want, you can save your own prompts. So if you want to add a new prompt template, you can just fill this out and you can also put your name and URL and decide if you want to share it publicly. If you don't want to share it publicly, that's perfectly fine too. But this is just so freaking cool. And what I love about it is that ChatGPT is still something that we're all learning and we're all learning it together. So as people are coming up with new ideas and new prompts and sharing them together, we're all getting better for it. So the people that are working together are the ones that are gonna come out on top. And I just love that, it warms my heart. Aww. All right, so let's go back here and check out the disc or the uh, mid journey art they gave us. That's pretty good. I asked for a cute cat and it gave me pretty much the cutest cats you could possibly imagine, right? So it has uses for mid journey. It has uses for a whole bunch of other stuff. Also, they have a training and community area uh, where you can actually come in here and engage with other users. And you can come in here and sort by topic. So you can see SEO, unsure, generative AI, copywriting, productivity. Let's check out the productivity ones. Extract facts and summarize. Analyze the website, summarize. Do it with one of my own articles. Pretty sweet. So I don't wanna show you every single thing it can do. I just wanted to show you that it is here and that you can use it and you should be using it. The link is available down below in the description, or you can just type in AI PRM extension. And as long as you're on Google Chrome, it'll pop up, it'll look like this. 400,000 users, trust that, trust that. So that's it guys, really quick video. Thank you so much for watching. And if you want to watch more, check out one of the videos above. 
Also be sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video and want more just like it. All right, thank you. See you in the next one.